Now to election matters, the Independent National Electoral Commission has accredited 111 domestic and international organizations and deployed 3,554 observers for the Yondo State Governorship election. INEC Chairman Mahmoud Yakubo, who disclosed this at a stakeholders meeting held at the International Events and Cultural Center, said the commission is determined to conduct a credible election. Senior reporter Ayodeji Muradio has more. This stakeholders meeting is one of the crucial steps taken by the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, ahead of the Undo State Governorship election slated for November 16. 17 political parties will participate in this election and many of them are present at this meeting. We are very pleased with my own party. One after another, they mounted the podium to speak with the majority of the candidates praising the state resident electoral commissioner, Uluato Babalola, for her impartiality and commitment to a credible election. The security agencies, the political parties and all of us, the candidates, by conducting ourselves properly to ensure that there is peace in the Ndo state. Beyond the rhetoric of politicking, she has held this fort like a professional. She's shown competence, she's shown dedication, and she has discharged her duties effectively and efficiently. Uh, I want to let you know that we have registered our protest on a lot of issues. And the last one being the fact that few people that are close to certain political parties that are still working in INEC should be recused of their responsibility so that there be credibility. INEC chairman Mahmoud Yaku expressed optimism that the commission will perform beyond expectations during the election. The commission has accredited 111 domestic and international organizations deploying 3,554 observers for the election. We are deploying the Beavers machines for voter accreditation at polling units and for upload of results to the INEC result being important. The representative of the Inspector General of Police promised that the police will ensure a peaceful election. All stakeholders will accuse violence, avoid the do or die approach, should not employ targets and play the game according to the rule in the spirit of sportsmanship. The electoral body has again assured the political parties of its neutrality. INEC says it will conduct a peaceful, credible and fair election on November 16th. Ayodeji Moradeyo, TVC News, Akure. We're also hearing from the Nigeria police first, um, saying that 22,000